Hello and welcome to my GM mode with Keeney from Recharge Wrestling. We're in week 26. Clash of Champions is done. We're heading towards Hell in a Cell. And we've just... Sorry, oh, that double cost card could be useful uh, with how much money they've got. But we need the most popular female face and heel against each other this week. Who is that? That's Liv and Raquel, which is level 3 rivalry, so I could do that actually. I could definitely do that and risk someone getting injured. It gets my commission a goal, yeah. That's fine, I can do that one. No problem. So Brock wants a title match, I'm sure he said. Yeah, within three weeks. Like, could I do that this week? I mean, probably, I'll probably main event with Liv and Raquel again. It's, abs it's the absolute classic. I mean, big in Brock probably isn't even good enough to bait to open. It's going to have to be in a mid card, I think. Um, again, just looking at stamina. Priest has only got 13 stamina, so I think I'll have to do a call out between Priest and Dewey Carter. Priest has got three, Carter's got two, so Priest can call out Dewey Carter. So what else have we got rivalry wise? Carmella and Shayna. How are they looking stamina wise? Shayna's stamina is alright. If we have Shayna. Not two bruises against Rabau, and then we have a run in from Carmella on Shayna. Yeah, we could do that, but what could we open with? I mean, if I could get a bruiser in to fight against Taker, a face bruiser. Uh, Jinder. Otis? Gunter McGurda, 24 popularity. I mean, you could bring in Cena for 10 weeks. And I can do Cena and Taker for Hell in a Cell. Yep, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do it. But well, Taker's stamina is low. Taker's stamina is low. Okay, fine. Cena can call out Taker because Cena's mic skills is are great. Okay. I got a well, priest is doing a call out, so I don't need him in a match. I got anything for Charlotte Flair right now? Maybe we'll just put out th those two in the opener. I mean, I wonder whether I should just give the title to Brock. We have Brock and MVP for the belt. As our feuds. That's probably where the money lies, isn't it? Rather than Big E having the belt. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. <laughs> Brock win the belt there. We could put something on this match because um, they're both good at extreme rules. Okay, that's cool. Even this match, the stamina is alright. And we'll just throw a tables one there. Yep. Cool, that costs us 33. It's not a lot. Uh, we've got one more promo slot to fill up. Let's just try and get some popularity for AJ, I think, will be our... Next goal, cool. So that is our guy. Let's book the logistics of it all. Yeah, 200k might be a bit much. Yeah, 185. I'm going to go to the big stadium this week. I just not get any optional goals for that. Uh, 
I mean, a little bit TLC. I don't think I need that. Health spar. I mean, health spar against anyone I could use that for. Taker might be the one. If I'm not using Taker this week, he could go to a health spar. Yep, no problem. Just contract negotiation. He's got five. He's got 11. Shayna's only got two. I'm going to need Shayna to stay. Because I need her for the pay per view. Yeah. Okay. I've played a couple of power cards there. There's no injury, injured stars. I mean, maybe another health spar could be useful. Maybe this Vita around the superstar could be useful. Yep. I'm going to do that. So I just got a couple of power cards. Um. So what the fuck use this health spar now? There's no one I need to use it on that's not involved. Okay, that's the show. Let's go. Let's go. Let's start building towards Hell in the Cell. As we have Charlotte and Belair in the opening of the tables match. Charlotte beats Belair. If we're going to get a rivalry started here, no two and a half star opener. Not anything special. Priest and Dewey Carters are level three. Good. Big E and Brock, I think, might beat the opener, but Brock Lesnar is our new champion, and that's what I wanted. Big E, maybe just two and a half star, though, not a great match. Cena and Taker, excellent promo, level one rivalry. Baszler and Rabau. Rabau beats Shayna Baszler in a three star match. Level three rivalry, Carmella and Baszler. AJ promo is okay, plus one. And Raquel and Liv, old faithful in the main event. They could get injured here, but Liv beats Raquel. In her hometown in a four-star match. Level four and they're not injured. Brilliant. Okay, I'm happy with that show. Really happy with that. Nikki and Becky, they're in this open stadium again. They're using their money to book all the um, stuff they need. I mean, Nikki won, but she's injured in a four-star match. Corbin for good promo. 5,000 fans. Bait and Theory. Bait beats Theory there. A three and a half star. Bartel, an excellent promo, plus five. I mean, Bartel's good, plus five bro. It's so frustrating. Tamin and Rio want a match, three star. Drew and Roderick was good, but nothing. And Mansour and Monsu, these guys, and I don't know how they keep this going. And three and a half side, it's another rivalry. These guys have always been rivaling. It's ridiculous. I don't know how they're doing it. Going against everything that. <laughs> all the best practices is what they're going against, and they're getting it right. It's mad. It's a popularity set. Gonzalez is up to 90 popularity now. So we actually lost 2,000 fans that week. We were getting 281k. Interesting that we lost fans. I wonder why that happened. Interesting. We're still number one though. That's all that really matters. They gained 20,000. So they've gained 18,000 fans on us. Then up to one and a half million. We're at 500k. That's all right. With 4,000 fans in front still. Despite these fans. Brock and Carmella are our champions. There's a three weeks still ahead in the cell. Uh, must have missed Ali off the card. Sorry. Brock is loving Smackdown. That's what we like to see. Oh, I should have had Ali make an appearance. Oh well. Oh well. Mustafa Ali is not the worst in the world. So we've the gap has been reduced drastically now. We're four thousand fans. But I think we've got rivalries in a good place. We've still got three weeks to build some more as well before the pay-per-view. So I think we've got a lot of past leaves right now. I think we're in a good position to smack down. So I'll end it there. So like, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time as we continue to build up uh, towards the next pay-per-view.